for this past year has been full of weather events from flooding to very little snow and then record heat. Is this normal or is our weather getting more extreme? Newswatch 16's Michelle Rotella got a little help from her storm tracker colleagues to come up with some answers. Extreme weather events seem to be happening all over the country. But even here in northeastern and central Pennsylvania, we've had our fair share. From catastrophic flooding in September to a freak snowstorm in October, and now extreme heat and severe weather in the summer. But the main question is why? Is climate change really occurring, or are we just paying more attention to the weather now? Chief Meteorologist Tom Clark weighed in with his opinion. Well, I've seen my share, you know, the flooding, tornadoes, severe thunderstorms. I don't think we've seen any more than, we, than I did when, we, when I started. Uh, but there's certain, we get our fair share of severe weather. Some meteorologists are saying it's not the weather that has changed so much as the media attention and people becoming more aware of significant weather events. Our morning meteorologist Joe Snedeker says social media has played a big role in grabbing the people's attention to weather. With social media, networking, the internet, and even cable stations, you go back just 20, 30 years ago, there was none of that. So people are paying more attention to events now when they do happen than they did 20, 30 years ago. Meteorologist David Nicosio from the National Weather Service in Binghamton says, I've seen more record-breaking snowfall and flooding in the past 20 years, but that could be due to climate change. With a warmer climate, we have been getting more precipitation. So then comes the big question. Does global warming play a part in this severe weather pattern? Is man causing any, any increase in severe weather? Uh, I'm not going to rule that out. Maybe. I mean, there's global warming. We've seen a warmer uh, global atmosphere. We've seen that happening. We've seen that temperature going up. How much of that is man-induced? I'm not sure. I think most of it is natural. So back to the main question, is there an increase in frequency of severe weather? Well, since our records only go back to about 100 years, we only have a small scale picture of what's actually going on. It could take centuries to fully understand our global weather patterns. Meteorologist Michelle Rotella, Newswatch 16.